Hi, my name is Dr. Munir Rahman Anwar. I'm one of the pediatricians at Southeast Pediatrics. And today, we are talking about Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder, also known as ADHD. ADHD is a neurobiologic condition with symptoms dependent on the child's environment. There are actually three types, inattentive, hyperactive or impulsive, and combination. Inattentive type tends to disrupt the classroom. Hyperactivity type cannot stay seated for a prolonged period of time. An impulsive type frequently interrupts conversations or other people. ADHD symptoms might be first seen by the teacher in their environment of impulsivity and unable to focus, and so they bring it up to the parents who then bring it up to the pediatrician's view. We then give the parent two forms to fill out, uh, one for the parent to discuss their behavior and one for the teachers. Uh, once we review those, we're looking at their attention deficit, the hyperactivity deficit, but also anxiety, depression, and others including conduct disorder and oppositional defiant disorder, and lastly, learning disorders such as math versus spelling. Something I hear from parents is that my child does not have ADHD because they can play games and watch TV for hours but does not want to do homework or tasks at home. The difference is that watching TV or playing games, it does not require a lot of mental effort or thought. Whereas with homework and doing tasks, this does require more critical thinking. When treating ADHD, we don't immediately jump to medication. It's actually a multimodal treatment approach, and we usually start with behavioral therapy techniques, such as encouraging good behavior, giving clear directions and goals. And a lot of this can be accomplished through parent training, and that can occur at counseling sessions with a therapist, either at school or even at outside facilities. Otherwise, there are medication options, and that would be more discussed with your pediatrician. The most important thing I want parents to remember about ADHD is that if you have concerns, it is better to bring them in to the pediatrician because early intervention is really important and ADHD is manageable.